Wearing a Mueller Crusaders necktie and an expression befitting the setting, a teenager admits to driving recklessly and causing life-altering injuries to a friend. He had his license for about four months at the time it happened, late afternoon, October 23rd. The other youth jumped onto the running board. The driver sped up and braked rapidly. His friend hit the pavement in Moeller's back lot, busting an ankle, fracturing a skull, leaving him with a traumatic brain injury. Fighting back tears, his mother spoke about those first few hours and days. He didn't even know who I was. Yeah, it took him probably a week to even recognize me. So all I can tell you is that you know, um, it's totally changed his life, changed my life. Changed, too, for the teen at the wheel. The consequences include surrendering his license for a year and dealing with damage done to a friend. Juvenile magistrate Mary Schultz wanted assurance there was no intent to harm. We were just playing around. We just got off, like, we, uh, we just had band practice. So we were just joking around when we were leaving. After it happened, like, I... It was like so sad, like I can't believe like yeah, I really just did that to my friend. Normally attorneys exhale once cases are done, this one retains an unfinished quality. He's gonna go to the same school, no. he's gonna see his friend that he hurt, he's gonna be reminded constantly of that, and there's a burden that comes with that. For our client, um, he's, he's learned some things as well. It happened, the mother said, hopeful her son will eventually recover. And as that mother spoke today, it was not lost on anyone how this all grew out of a seemingly harmless bit of fun on familiar school ground on an otherwise normal, uneventful autumn afternoon. John London, WWT News 5.